Hey guys, you ever wonder what's up with the preview placement and the preview of a bitmap image or uh, e-drawings inside SolarWorks PDM? Well, this Q-tip is for you. So whenever you're browsing through your PDM vault, sometimes you, you need a little bit of extra performance with regard to getting into a folder. Uh, you know, sometimes the files, whenever they display, you know, it's, it's actually doing the get latest version. And so you need that preview instead of being the full e-drawings preview, you want that to be a, a bitmap. So let's take a look. How do we set that up? If you go to the display menu and then under file preview, this file preview turns on and off whether or not you actually have a preview. So this, whenever I disable it, it shows preview as disabled. There's also the option to have this card preview, which shows you the variables of the card. It's not actually the card but you do have the ability to look at the variable values on the at tab and then also the default configuration, those two configurations that are showing. But since I've disabled the preview, that means that I can browse my vault in a, a much more efficient manner. Well, let's just step it up just a little bit. And instead of, uh, instead of actually disabling the preview, that's, which is one way to get a little bit more performance. Let's go turn, turn back on the file preview, but then go to the display, slide down to options, and then let's, include show bitmap for SOLIDWORKS files. What this will do is it will keep in your file archive, it will create a bitmap image of the part or of the assembly or of the drawing, and it will place that into that folder for you. And a bitmap, as you know, is a much smaller representation of the file that can then be pulled down to your local cache much faster. So once this is enabled, then every file that you select is going to have a bitmap preview image. So it's not using the full e-drawings. Let's just say that for a moment that I want to convert that to the e-drawings viewer on the fly. All I have to do is hover over the window and click left click and it turns into the e-drawings viewer. And then I can now have the full UI. Well, let's take a look at the options that are available for that. Go to display, go to options. And then we have the ability to show the full UI in the SOLIDWORKS preview. Right now it's not enabled. So let's turn that on. And you'll see that I now get the full e-drawings menu bar up top. And as you know, this preview window is uh, quite dynamic. Inside PDM, if I have you know, a SOLIDWORKS file, it's going to show me the e-drawings e graphical viewer. If I go to the change order folder where I have XML files in here, those are XML files with a CSS that has the layout set for me. And it should actually look like a form. So now the viewer, the preview window has become a, an Internet Explorer window, and I still have the ability to right click and print preview directly from this window, and I can see what it's going to look like when I print it. We also have the ability to set the preview uh, placement. Right now, mine is set at the bottom. If I turn it to the right, sometimes that is very helpful to some of our customers. So if I maximize this window, I have my full list that's very long, and now any file that I select, I've got a much larger preview window over here. So then I select the file, and then I, now I have a, a much larger window to work with. I hope this Q-tip has been helpful for you. Believe in the Q.